I remember throw back in the stoli. I done ran into some rides my dolly. 17, but they treat me like an OG. Niggas know me, but get shows on the multi. Everything fell in line like I'm supposed to be. They suck us online, trying to roast me. Two blunts for the sleep, now I'm toasty. Big bro said, grind, okie dokie. Work hard, cause I'm waiting for my trophy. You can say what you want, don't approach me. How the shouts in this block if you know me? What is going on, YouTube, man? It's your boy, Jay, and I'm coming at y'all boys with another bang, man. So I need y'all boys to like this video and subscribe. But as y'all boys can see by the thumbnail, I am coming at y'all boys with a how to rep up method. Now, look, if you know anybody trying to hit legend in this last month, share this video with them right now, all right? Share this video with them right now. This is the last chance to hit Legend before NBA 2K22 comes out. And I know some of you might say, oh, who still play the game? Yes, there's some people who still play the game and want to hit Legend, bro. <clears throat> Listen, if you are E2 and up, you have the chance to hit Legend, all right? If you are E1, it's going to be really, really hard. But anything lower than E1, you have no chance of hitting Legend. But in this video right here, if you're in Elite 2 and up, and you want to hit legends watch the whole video you will not regret it. if you want to hit e1 and you're a superstar one you can maybe even hit e2 but i'm gonna teach you guys the best ways to hit legend if, anyways let's get right into this banger man let's go all right so now we're here now look i'm gonna show you guys the best ways to hit legend all right so the first thing that you guys want to do the first thing that you guys want to do is look at this see what percent you are at see what percent you guys can see i'm i'm like six or seven i'm at one two three Four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. One, two, three, four, five. Six. I'm seventh on the leaderboard, so I definitely know what I'm talking about. All right, definitely know what I'm talking about. All right, so look, I'm gonna show you guys the best ways to hit legend right now. So what you guys want to do, right? Want to go to the neighborhood? Want to go to the event schedule, right? So you guys see all these events coming up, but these are the double rep events. These events gives you more rep than any than regular playing. All right, so you're gonna have the special appreciation. Special appreciation. This is the best event to wrap up right over here, right? So you have the playmaker. So if you have Hall of Fame playmaking, you will get three times the rep. Instead of two times rep, you will get three times rep, all right? So this right here, you could go from literally Superstar 3 to E1, E1 to E2, right? Here. I think you could do that if you really, really try right here. All right, so the next thing we have dime time from 8 to 12, all right? Dime time is really, really easy to wrap up. Just play park, throw lobs, you know what I'm saying? Then you got basketball gods, basketball gods, basketball gods, basketball gods, all right? This is double rep for four days. I mean, four times in two days, all right? This is a lot of double rep. All right, then we got cages. All right, cages is the only bad double rep, so you could skip cages. Then you got core conquer, core conquer, core conquer. Three core conquers, all right? Literally, you could rep up so much in these. You, you guys don't even know. You could probably go from E3 to Legend in all these events right here just in this short amount of time. So imagine what you could do with the E2 bar to E3 bar or, or E1 to E2, you know what I'm saying? Then you got Dunk Fest, then you got Rush, Rush. It's all easy 1v1s, all easy, all easy double rep, all right? Just look at the times, make sure you're available at those times. And, and if you really want to hit Legend, if that's what your goal is, then, then hit it, all right? Then the next thing that you guys want to do when there's no double rep, rep event, all right? You want to create a pro -M team, all right? You're gonna create a prom team. I'm not gonna create one. I'm just gonna tell you guys you're gonna create a prom team. Then what you're gonna do after you hit like amateur gold or something like that, you're gonna get out of the prom team. You're gonna disband it and make a new one because sometimes it, it doesn't give you games right away. So you're gonna make a new one, all right? You're gonna make a new one and you're just gonna keep doing that, all right? Keep doing that when there's no double rep, all right? Keep doing that, all right? So you guys have that, all right? Now the next thing that you guys wanna do. Right, if you guys do not want to play prom, play park, you know what I'm saying? Play on those two scores, play on the three score, th throw your lobs, all right? Now, the next thing I want to tell you guys, right? The next thing I want to tell you guys is if you are a guard, you must have Hall of Fame playmaking in order to get the most rep, all right? If you are a big man, I suggest make a blue red only if you want rep, not if you want to be the best, all right? The best type of big is all red, all right? Make sure you guys know that the best type of big is all red, gold finishing. But if you want rep with it, then you have to make a Hall of Fame finishing and a Hall of Fame red. All right? But if you want the most playmaking, I mean, if you want the most rep, 
for the big mans i posted a video on that it's um finishing hall of fame and a playmaking hall of fame but that's not a good build to play on i mean you could probably play park on it but it's not a good like it's not an actual good build it's just a good rep build right but the best Rep build and good build is Hall of Fame finishing and Hall of Fame rebounding. All right, so that's for big man. Lockdowns do not get no rep. Spot ups do not get no rep. So if you want to rep up, I suggest you not make that. All right, so if you're a guard, you must have, you must have Hall of Fame playmaking. All right, you can have Hall of Fame playmaking, Hall of Fame shooting. That's fine. It still gives you a lot of rep. All right. All right, now the next thing that you guys want to do is go into the spin the wheel. You guys already know it's a big part before you even play anything, all right? I should have went here first, but before you play anything, you want to go into spin the wheel, all right? Want to go into spin the wheel? Look, if you are at least one or under, try to hit that double rep, right? Now, let me teach you guys a trick. This is a trick that I always do, all right? So let's say special appreciation is 12 p.m. or 12 a.m. Whenever you get on and you want to play this event, right be two minutes, literally two minutes before the event starts, come in here, spin your wheel. If you hit double rep on the wheel, if you hit double rep on the wheel and you get three times rep, that is six times rep. You could literally go up so much percent, you guys don't, that's six times the rep, all right? You guys have to understand, six times, that's not normal, that's insane, all right? But let's say dime time, all right? It's eight dime time starts. You you guys can see eight p.m. to twelve a.m. So at seven fifty eight p.m. you want to come in here and spin your wheel. If you hit double rep, you will get four times rep for dime times. All right. If you're on an E one or up, just do the same thing, but on these wheels. You know what I'm saying? Let, let me hit bonus real quick. Let me show you how to. Let me show you guys how to hit bonus real quick. All right. Let me let me show you guys. Let me just show you guys why I'm the best at this bonus stuff. Let me show you guys real quick. I'm about to hit bonus right now. I'm about to hit bonus right now, live. Psych, I lied. All right. All right, look. I lied about hitting bonus, but I'm about to hit it on this wheel right here. I'm not trolling, bro. I, I'm literally not trolling. This video is almost done, but, but just keep sticking around, bro. Keep sticking around. I'm about to hit this bonus real quick. You guys already know my body. Big bonuses. <coughs> Not lying. Watch. I told y'all, I'm too much, bro. That bonus is too easy. That bonus is too easy. Now nah, I'm just playing. But yo, look. All right, so I'm almost done with this video. Now look, I showed you guys everything, right? I showed you guys everything. Now the last final thing, all right? Get a, a friend from home. Look, get a friend from home that will help you, all right? If he doesn't have a high rep account, be like, yo, look, play on my account, play park, and this is um, this is what I did, alright, look, I had a couple of my friends play on my account, and when I got off, they would hop on, like, I didn't play all my games on my account, everybody thinks I played, no, I go outside, like, damn, I go outside and stuff like that, you know what I'm saying, so look, get a friend, if it's too much for you, tell your friend, look, help me rep up. So he's going to get some percent when you're off. And then when he hops off, you hop back on. So it's like your account is being played on 24 hours, all right? That's the final trick, all right? Anyways, appreciate you guys for watching this video, and I'm out.